Seth, how are you? I am very well, thank you. Okay, nice. What have you been doing while in Cartagena? Uh, so in Cartagena, I have been volunteering at a senior center uh, and staying with the host family and it has been lovely. Okay. How has the experience been volunteering here? Uh, as I say, it's been lovely. Um, uh, the volunteer experience has been really great, actually. This is my first time doing anything like this, uh, and I've really had a wonderful time. Um, the, the people here are just incredibly sweet uh, and incredibly wonderful to spend time with. Um, and some of them speak some English. Uh, my Spanish has, um, has definitely been helped by it, but sort of between us, we're able to have a pretty good conversation. Uh, and they're just wonderful to talk to. It's wonderful to, to learn about their experiences and meet them and get to know them. Okay. How's your Spanish right now? Has it improved? Uh, creo que sí. Está mejorando mucho. Uh, <laughs> it was, I think, pretty decent when I got here, but it's definitely been getting better. Uh, I mean, I've been having to use it almost all the time. Um, this is one of the most extensive conversations I've had in English since I've gotten here. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's definitely been improving a lot. Okay. Do you have any recommendation for the next volunteer? Um, you know, I think just be, just be ready to go, ready to jump in and do something. Um, uh, be enthusiastic. I think especially if you're, if you're working at, at a senior center like I have been, um, you know, I found that there are some people who at first seem a little shy and seem like they maybe don't want to talk to me but it's actually just because they don't necessarily know how to approach. Um, and I think most of the people here are really, really happy to have someone to talk to, honestly. So I think just sort of be, be open, be outgoing uh, is, the, is the main thing I would say. How was the experience with your host family? Uh, they are really, really wonderful. Um, I miss them already. I really loved staying with them. Um, yeah, just incredibly sweet people. Very, very good food. Uh, yeah, it's been great. <laughs> awesome. What about the cultural differences? Um, let's see, what are some cultural differences? I mean, uh, you know, things are a little more disorganized here, mm -hmm. um, especially especially the, the transportation. Yes. Um, uh, I, yeah, the, I mean, the bus is a very, very different experience from back home. Um, the taxis are also an interesting difference because you have to like negotiate in advance. Uh, but uh, you know, it's I, I can't think of anything off the top of my head that is that different other than those things. Okay, nice. Um, what can you do in your free time in Cartagena? Uh, I spent a lot of time just walking around, mm -hmm. actually, just sort of getting to know the place. Um, I mean, I spend most of my free time probably downtown uh, in La Ciudad Vieja and in uh, Getsemane. Mm -hmm. um, and I, both of those neighborhoods are really, really delightful to walk around. Um, but I did a little bit of exploring around my neighborhood as well, where I was staying. Uh, and also yesterday I went to a baseball game. That was very fun. <laughs> um, there's a lot to do. Okay, nice. How was the local staff over other view? Did they help you? They are fantastic. Uh, uh, yeah, very, very helpful. Um, very friendly. Yeah, I, I cannot say enough good things about them. Really, really a wonderful job. Okay, nice. What about a brother of you in the US? Did they help you too? Yeah, they were also helpful. Um, I didn't have to contact them quite as much, um, but most of my contact I did sort of on the, on the chat system on the website. And it actually all worked out fine. Um, when I first booked the trip, I ended up I ended up not booking this until pretty late, mm -hmm. uh, and they were very helpful with that. And then I actually ended up uh, the week before I came down here, I ended up making a, a change to my plans, and they were very helpful with that um, and coordinating with people down here as well. Okay. Do you recommend a brother view for those who want to volunteer abroad? Yes, absolutely. I recommend it. Thank you very much.